What's up guys? This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to create an automatic backup daily of your FortiGate config. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to do this through the command line. What you're going to need is a USB drive that you can plug in to your FortiGate device. In this lab I'm using a FortiGate 30 Wi-Fi. It can be any FortiGate with a USB device. So first what we're going to do is we're going to log in, we're going to get into the command line. And the first thing I'm going to do is show you how to format your USB drive that's plugged in. It will need to be formatted with, you know, whatever the FortiGate system uses. So in order to do that, we're going to do execute USB disk. And we're going to list. This is just going to show you the files that are currently on the USB drive. This was me practicing with another file. So we're going to do execute USB disk and then we're going to format. It's going to ask you if you want to continue, type Y. It's going to take a few seconds here to format the disk. Once that's done, we're just going to check to see it should have deleted all of the files. So we're going to do execute USB disk list. No files are going to be on the drive. It's brand new, completely reformatted. After this, I'm just going to show you the command that we're going to use in the script that we're going to build. So the backup command is execute backup, and then you'll see the different options here. You could do config, full config. I did full config for this, and then here are the different ways you can do it. So you can always do it with FTP, TFTP. We're gonna do USB in this tutorial, and I'm just gonna name it the Fortify 30E backup. You can also enter a password if you wanna encrypt it, just like you can in the GUI. I didn't choose to do that here, so. Just to show you that the command works, this executed a backup on demand, and we're gonna go ahead and execute USB disk to list the files, and you can see the backup config is now on our USB drive. Now, that of course didn't create a script to automatically do it, so that's what we're gonna do here. So to configure a script, you're gonna do config system auto script, and then edit whatever the name you want your script to be called. I chose backup. And then after you type set, you can hit question mark and it'll show you the different options you need to configure for your script. So for the interval, you can put it for as many seconds as you want. Um, here I chose 86, 400, just because that 24 hours, I wanted to back up the config once a day. So that's why I set it for that. You're gonna set how many times you want it to repeat. I chose zero because I wanted to indefinitely repeat um, and continue the process. For start, you wanna set start to auto, which will automatically start the script. And then when you choose the command set script, this is where in quotations, you're gonna put the command that you want it to execute every 24 hours. So we're gonna use that command that we used in the previous uh, diagram. Execute backup full, full config USB fortify, the same command that we just entered. Um, to do the backup on demand. And you're gonna end quotes. And then for output size, it's just, you really don't have to do this, but I always make sure I enter every value, set output size, the default is 10, and then you're gonna hit end. This should automatically start the script. So what we're gonna do to check to make sure that it started, make sure there's a backup file, execute USB disk list. And as you can see, the new file has been created the script has run successfully and it will continue to run and that file will be updated every day with a new date at the same exact time with a new configuration. That's going to be the end for this tutorial. If you guys like the tutorial, leave a like, thumbs up, leave a comment down below. If there's any other tutorials that you'd like to see from me in the future, I plan on doing more tutorials regarding Fortinet gear and equipment since it's something that I deal with on a daily basis for my job. Um, please leave a comment with what you'd like to see and I'll try to see if I can set it up in lab and take care of it. Uh, thank you for watching and have a great day.